Stoke City have never finished higher than ninth in the Barclays Premier League at the start of play, eighth in the league. And it could be a record-breaking season for the Potters with Europe, a very real possibility. And they took the lead in the 13th minute through Ibrahim Afalai against lowly Swansea, a free header, and Stoke's 200th goal scored at the Britannia in the Premier League. Afalai celebrating just as he was for his country during the recent international break, and deservedly in front were the Potters. Swansea offered very little in the first half and into the second half it got even better for the home side and it was Boyan getting in on the act. His second Premier League strike of the campaign and his first since Boxing Day against Manchester United here. Swansea must be sick of the sight of him as he scored the winner at the Liberty in Stoke's 1-0 win there in October. It's now just one clean sheet in 17 Premier League away days for the Swans, but once it went 2-0, Swansea were a different animal, and an injection of pace and ambition saw them back into the game. Gilfie Sigurdsson on the turn, a deflection, getting the better of Premier League debutant Haugard in the Stoke goal in for the injured Jack Butland, and it was game on at the Britannia. Sigurdsson now into double figures for league goals this campaign, and an intriguing end to the contest. It would turn out to be. Montero was brought on. He changed the game, certainly. And with Paloshi brought on also by coach Guidelin on the turn. And again, another deflection. And the luck was with Swansea. Back from the dead. 2-2. And his second league goal since his January arrival from Kievo off the bench to do a job. And that was to fire in the equaliser. Great game. 2-2.